even though I can tell myself that I'm like okay, it's I still like think about the set all the time. Yo, what's up, man? What's up? Hey, Ben. Good, dude. How about you, man? Pretty good. Yeah, we uh, haven't uh, really discussed since yeah. Uh, summit. Yeah, it's been a while. I kind of uh. I went to Michigan for like 10 days and I just didn't do anything. So that was like good for me, I think, because I just like relaxed. Did you have to like recover? Uh, I mean, yeah, I think so. Like, then it, it, it's still like, even though I can tell myself that I'm like, okay, it's, I still like think about the set all the time. I was going to ask, dude, like, how, like, are, how much are you thinking about it? How much are you like over it? Are you ever going to be over it? Like, yeah, how are you feeling? Uh, I mean, I don't think I can get over it just because, like, that, I, I feel like that would make me, like, a weaker competitor if I didn't think about that. But I have to, like, be able to look at it objectively for what it is. Yeah. Uh, but yeah, it yeah, sucks. <laughs> Dude, you were in serious mode at Summit. Like, yeah, yeah. Sorry you and if I, I wasn't super social. <laughs> no, 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 no. I did, like, I hope you realized I gave you some space. Like, yeah, yeah, you, know, yeah. You, you and I were chatting, like, once a week. I feel like we're pretty chill, but like you were serious. And like, I'd see people go out. At, did you ever go out at night other than like the first night with the, mm, I didn't go out. out. I would, I would like watch movies at like people's hotel rooms and stuff. Cause that's okay. the way I really unwind. Um, yeah, but I can't, I can't go out and drink. <laughs> like, Dude, like none and I were out at bars until like 2 AM. <laughs> I was hanging out. Like mango is in, uh, you know, in one of the hotel rooms with like Lucky and SUJ and we're all chilling, drinking and stuff. But I didn't see you out like that at all. Yeah, no, I don't. I didn't drink until. Well, I drank in the hot tub stream, but oh, I feel like well, I, yeah, I had yeah, to. Yeah, like if, I, if I'm yeah. like dead sober doing that, I feel like oh, I don't want to live in that world. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> but uh, no, I. The, the problem with losing and drinking is it feels like unhealthy. But I'm like, you know what? I'm fine. Uh, yeah, was, yeah. I, I can't make it depressive, though. <laughs> Yeah, and dude, I I love you're straight humble, man. Like I saw I you the other it. night. I saw you the other night getting advice from Kadoran. Like you're clearly you're clearly the better Marth, right? No doubt, you're the better Marth. But it's so cool that you realize that other Marths can teach you shit. And dude, he was telling me about that tech chasing shit at Summit, and he was like, "You have to wait for the apex of the conversion point." And I'm like, "What the <laughs> fuck are you talking about?" But like, no, I like I started understanding what he was saying. Rhythmically, I mean. Yeah, 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 yeah. All that. Good yeah, man. Stuff. But you were uh, you're super serious at tournaments, so that's really respectful. <laughs> yeah, I guess you've never seen me outside no, of like a Xanadu no. local or like. Yeah, exactly. I haven't. Yeah, no, I get a. Uh, I mean, I I kind of balance it where, I'll still like uh. Try to like relax yeah, a little yeah. bit. Like but we sat I'm... down and had a meal or two together, but like I was all business. Were... Yeah, yeah, you were all business. Yeah, it was crazy. So you know, mad respect for that. Something else that I think people just really don't realize about Summit is that the amount of high level matches that you're exposed to when it comes to watching. So all those friendlies, because that's all people are doing. They're just they're just playing friendlies, playing friendlies, playing friendlies. Mm -hmm. None of that's being streamed. You have private access to all these top level matches that will never be seen again. So I mean, like, of oh yeah, course, I caught, yeah, I saw you watching a bunch. Oh my god! So yeah. I mean, I was playing a bunch, but watching a bunch was so useful too. Mm -hmm. yeah. Um, and that's something you'll no one else will ever have access to unless you're there, because they're not like posting that and that wasn't recorded. It's just you know how many times you have to wait till these individuals run into each other in bracket, right? And Instead who knows when that's going to happen? Literally hours of friendlies, because most people when they link up to play will play for like at least an hour, right? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Yeah, yeah. Oh my god, yeah. Yeah, it was so crazy. And Axe and Ops were hilarious. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. They were always... just having way too much fun playing Melee. <laughs> they were just like la everyone's all like serious and training and they're just in the corner laughing hysterically at their yeah, game. Yeah, they had that they had their little setup. <laughs> yeah, yeah, dedicated. Yeah, yeah. yeah. They just enjoy the game too much. Yeah. Really funny. Uh, what's your next uh in person event? Dude, I don't know cuz I'm a little You're not worried. Doing no, not Riptide. Mango's not going either, and I don't yeah. want to go to the first one, especially mm. with like Delta yeah. on the rise. And uh, I think a lot, I think a lot of people are like kind of over the pandemic, where they're like, "Yeah, it's the hard part's over," but I, I they're don't ready know. to come out. Yeah. yeah, even people who are treating it safely, like at the beginning, are now just mm -hmm. like, "No, it's fine now." But I don't know. I I don't want to risk it. I don't I don't want to rush in and just have it be a terrible idea. 
Yeah. Um, especially because like I I stay with family a lot, and mm-hmm. it's just not worth it to me unless like I know for sure. Like Summit was different because it was an invitational. And, and everyone uh, they checked all like everyone we had is no proof of vaccination. Yeah. yeah, there's not they're not gonna be able to check that at all. No, <laughs> like well, isn't there another summit in December? Yeah, there's that. So I'll definitely go to that. Um, okay, but I want to go. Like I'm registered for main stage in November. I want to go to the one in California. Yeah, in Ontario, okay. California. Yeah, yeah. Um, I want to go to Low Tide City in Texas, but Texas is also really bad with like COVID wise. But well, I don't. Yeah. Yeah, what frustrates me is being on the East Coast because I really want to go. Dude, I was out. I was clean. I had a clean break. I was fucking done with with melee and the community and the scene. Mm-hmm. And I went to Summit and I made friends. And I'm like, oh, I miss these people you now. What's my yeah. next event? And like, it sucks because um, November is mm-hmm. main stage, December Summit, and then January is Genesis. And it's like for us east coasters i don't know it just sucks that they're all in california there's that one smash con it's not actually smash con but it's like a mini one that i don't know how big that's gonna be Mm -hmm. it would be cool if they were actually a full-fledged smash con yeah i mean yeah of course i just don't know if i can justify flying out to california would you would you do summit again i think dude it's so worth it right originally i was like one and done it's a lot of money i just want to say i've done it i'm done and then i did it i was like I gotta do this again. Mm-hmm. Like this has gotta happen again. If you're if you're heavily invested into melee, like at all, I think it's <laughs> and you have the cash. I'd like to, yeah, like, to justify. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I think it's completely worth it. Well, that's what I've been telling people in my stream is that like f- anything that's stopping you, if it's time off work, if, if it's cash, whatever, see if you can get around that if you're interested because it's it's without a doubt worth it. Yeah. Yeah, it's it's worth a little bit of sacrifice and saving or whatever you need to do to go. Well, what was your absolute favorite part? Oh my gosh, um, I would say hanging out with none. The, yeah. the dude is fucking hilarious. He's really funny. Yeah, really funny. And I realized that him streaming is really a character. Yeah. I didn't know how much of a, like a role he was playing when streaming. Of course, even, even, and not even talking about Wizzy or, or Wizzy fan or, or, Bond. or Bond. Just like him as a person, mm-hmm. he seems he seems a little more serious when he's streaming. But like he's so much more laid back, a lot funnier. Just and he's a little bit more. I don't know, social. It feels like. Yeah, definitely. I think. Oh, dude. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He, he's super. Like, I'm so glad we're on the same team because we also yeah. got to do like karaoke. Uh, oh, like before awesome. summit yeah we went to like at korean barbecue like me him and mm-hmm. tof and like the rest of the golden guardians that's so cool so fun, no yeah. my abs would be like hurting by the end of the night and uh <laughs> um no fizzy actually came out with us one night and uh yeah he's cool too we, ta- yeah. we, we like we all were at a bar and just kind of talked to like 2 a.m about his plans and how um rollback is going and it was crazy just to like have him in front of you for two hours just like picking his brain about how he thinks everything mm-hmm. is yeah it's cool right to have it yeah, all converge oh into this God. one like crazy yeah, experience i know, <laughs> I know. And it yeah. was weird when uh ludwig walked in and like i don't know just like seeing like had everyone you, had from... you never met him before oh no no not at all right yeah i didn't even know what i didn't know him as slime's friend like, no yeah because you're I, out i was out i first heard about him when he was doing his like streamathon mm-hmm yeah. Um, so I mean, yeah, amazing experience, dude. Just, yeah, it was just great. Oh, and Mafia, dude, I fucking love <laughs> yeah. Mafia. I didn't touch Mafia. How did it go? Did you win oh, anything? Oh my god! Yeah, yeah. I, 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 Scar played me real hard, dude. Did he? Yeah, he got me real good. We he was Mafia, and we set up an alliance like first round, and I no. hung with him till the end. No, town still won, but I I don't feel you like felt he wounded. Won. Yeah, I still feel defeated. <laughs> yeah, yeah. He had full trust in them. Oh my god, he played me and like I I never watched Mafia, so a lot of people are like, Oh, it was obvious he was lying. He wasn't being like typical scar. I'm like, I don't know that shit. Yeah. No, that's not fair. <laughs> and it's it's real obvious when you can look at all the roles. Mm-hmm. So like when you know who everyone is, oh, it's a lot more. Yeah, obvious. yeah. When you're in Twitch yeah. chat, it's completely yeah, everyone. Yeah, like when you're there like in the circle, like... you really don't fucking know. Of course. Like, yeah. yeah, it's crazy. It's crazy. Um did you hear about Bond Snipe? No. So Bond showed up to one of the games. Oh yes, I do know this. You did hear was about it, that? Was it Sfat that he got? It was Sfat. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Bond shows up to the game. He's the uh, what is it? What's the role? Uh, he was vigilante. 
the vigilante, yeah. the very first night with no information, takes a shot and takes out the mafia. <laughs> and he was like, Bond doesn't miss. It was a no-scope. So stupid. <laughs> That's funny, though. Right. Oh, I mean, I feel like I could tell stories all night about it. Yeah, because we were there for a whole week and it was so much fun. Yeah. So, so good. Yeah.